And today I'm gonna talk about the full detail of BDS course. As BDS is Batis Dato Ki Seva, but the actual full form is the Bachelor of Dental Surgery. This is the course of five years, four plus one. Four years are studying years, and one year is internship, is which is mandatory. We talk about the first year, then there are four main subjects and two additional subjects which you have to read in the first year of dentistry. The first subject is the DADH that is Dental Anatomy and Dental Histology. Second is the Anatomy, third Biochemistry, fourth Physiology and the two supporting of dentistry which you read in first year that is the Prostodontics and Conservative Dentistry. Two practical based subjects are there. Followed by one more subject is also there that is DM, Dental Materials. Another subject of Dentistry only which you read from first year onward but it is not the main subject in case of first year of Dentistry. It is the main subject in second year of Dentistry. So in first year total you will read four main subjects and three additional subjects. With that the behavioral sciences or the environmental sciences are another subjects which are added in some colleges or which are added in first year. Here of dentistry in case of DADS subject you have to learn the carving on a wax cube which is very very important part as it has an exam which include the marks in your main exam. So, be prepared to the tooth carving on the wax block which is shown on your screen. Now begin with the second year of dentistry. In second year you have to read minimum 6 subjects. First one is the pharmacology, pathology and uh, microbiology followed by dental materials which you already read in first year also but now in second year that dental material subject is the main exam going subject. Followed by the practical subject that cons, that means the conservative dentistry and the prosthodontics. These two are practical based subjects which you already learned from first year onwards. But you have to give your exam in the second year and these two subjects, practical based subjects are the main subject. In case of conservative dentistry lab, you do the preclinical work which include your first year work also and as well as second year work also. In this you practice to restore the tooth in a dummy form. That means on a phantom and on the typho you will practice that how to restore the tooth. Different types of cavities are there and you have to take the sign on each and every step and complete your quota as well. A prosthodontic, a preclinical lab is there in the second year. You have to do the certain Exercises in that like how to take the impression from impression compound or thumb impression or you have to make the block from the uh, dental stone or from POP and perfect block should be there with proper measurement and you have to do the teeth setting, teeth arrangement, how to make the rim, how to pour the cast and then you have to make the denture base over it. So there are lots of preclinical work in the prosthodontics which you gonna have to learn in second year of dentistry. Now begin with the third year, a very interesting year where with the very less load because it has only three subjects. That is the GM, GS and OP. GM is journal medicine, GS is journal surgery and OP means oral pathology. You have to read about the lesions which are present in and out of the oral cavity in detail and this subject is very very interesting. Now in third year onward as you know there are less burden from the subject side so you have to start going to the clinics and learn the certain things, perform certain exercises, certain quotas and to assess the different dental procedures and even you can perform certain dental procedures as well. In third year of dentistry. As I said earlier that there is less burden in third year of dentistry. To reduce the stress of the final year subject that is the eight big subjects. 
we start reading those final year subjects in third year subjects of dentistry only as an additional subject having the separate lectures and the periods on those final year subject as well take little bit quota of final year in third year as a third year exercise or a third year quota in the clinics come to the finale of bds that is the final year of dentistry with eight subject that you have to read it very well you have to give the exam you have eight practicals to give in the final university exam eight subjects written exam is there along with that the quotas of all the eight subject is very very important during the exam time aapka quota ko chura na le that means no one will stole your quota so make sure you have to take care of your quotas as well quotas like you have to do the scaling approx 100 quadrants you have to do it you have to do certain restorations quota is there certain pre clinical rct is there on the extracted teeth so you have to perform all these quotas and complete it on time subjects of final year is the first one is the oral medicine and radiology second one is the periodontics third is pedodontics fourth one is community dentistry or public health dentistry and fifth one is the oral surgery Sixth one is the prosthodontics. Seventh is the orthodontics, and eighth is the endodontics and conservative dentistry. So after you completed all your quota, the seventy-five percent of attendance is mandatory in each and every year. From first year to final year onward, the seventy-five percent attendance is mandatory. Then only you can sit in the university exam. After you clear your university exam of final year, the internship, which is of twelve months and which is the mandatory part, you can do it from your college also or from any other college. It totally depends upon you. Again, if you have to change the college for the internship, I will definitely make another video regarding the whole information. If you really want to know about that, final year is quite hectic, and when you come to the internship, it is not hectic at all. But as a doctor, you will treat the patient, you will see and diagnose the patient very well. You can have a particular batch of internship and have a doctor in front of your name as well it will give you a feeling of becoming a doctor ye jo feeling aati hai na ye feeling sabse achhi feeling hoti hai internship part you can plan out your career like in which way you want to go already one video is out on my channel regarding you have to go to the mbs or you have to go to the diploma courses after bds so don't forget to check out that video so as you can design your internship and your career as well internship is the best time if you want to prepare for your pg in dentistry that means for the mds internship is the best time that you can prepare there is one youtube shot out already on my channel that is regarding the books which is important or from which you can prepare for the neat mds exam so don't forget to check out that youtube shot also i will definitely put the link of all these video and youtube shot in the description so don't forget to check out that see in the first year of dentistry we have 100 student but at the internt but at the time of exit of the bds we have only 80 or 70 or even the 60 people as a doctor and as a pass out so it's very important and a hurdle race that you have to run and learn and achieve the prefix doctor in front of your name so work hard don't take it a oh, dentistry bahut easy hai dentistry bilkul bhi easy nahi hai that's all about this video hope you like this video and if you like this video hit the like button along with that you can comment down if you have any query and you can also follow me on my instagram with my instagram id shown on your screen i will definitely put the link of that also in the description of this video if you still have any query you can drop me the mail which is shown on your screen thank you for watching